bladder fish. Bladder fish, that's right. So we need to want to top off our food, top off our hydration. Oxygen. I don't want to drown. Oh, I'm really glad we are right next to the surface. So that would have been very awkward. Bladder fish, bladder fish, bladder, 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 bladder fish. Boom, boom, boom. Mr. Sandman, bring me a dream. Make her the cutest that I've ever seen. Give her two lips. Like roses and clover, and tell her that the night's not over. I'm so alone, oh, got nobody to call my own. Drown like twice on your stream for below zero. <laughs> I've gotten close. I did die of dehydration, um, so I finally perished due to resource mismanagement. You know, I got that going for me, question mark. Um, well, I got better, and by that I mean I reloaded my save. Because <laughs> I was, uh, I had done a lot. It was actually really interesting because I had saved right before the rescue ship came in and I saw it get shot by the uh, planetary defense gun or the quarantine enforcement gun I might say um, and I forgot about it so as soon as I loaded I ran right back into the facility I got to see that we get alternate dialogue from the AI because it you know we don't get the radio signals from the ship but they're inbound your AI is just like detecting energy levels ship signal lost like, hmm, oh, yikes. All right, we're gonna make two lockers. Climb down. Yep, that's a locker grave, all right. Throw this out there. Throw this out there. <laughs> yeah. 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 Um. Well, hold on. I want to keep the top tablets and ion cubes just in case. Put that in there. Put the battery in here, just because I just, I just don't know. All right, let's make our food, water, and pipes. Make like a cut, make like a slug cat, and pipes. Oops, what's in our inventory? We need two peepers and a boomerang. Bunch of filtered water. We should also check out the data log for the uh, bacteria thing that we scanned ourselves on. I'm kind of. I feel like they should have had a bit more of an interesting way to do filtered or disinfected water. It's like, Bleach, though, like, that's just that's weird. Why not have, like, carbon, you know, filters and all that? Crunch. Damn, we satiated as fuck. Okay, um. 
Let's save our current progress. Actually, let's unpin the flashlight, because we just made one. Need the wiring kit. Need silver. Small amount of bleach can actually purify water. Really? Must be a very, very minuscule amount, because that just does not seem prudent. Can I make another bacon? Bacon. Bacon. Where's the bacon? The bacon go. Crazy? I was crazy once. And I made bacon. Oh, it's a deploy. Fucking damn it, Drecky. You foolish, foolish snake. Uh, I should grab some copper ore. I can do it. So let's shove a bunch of pi let's make a bunch of pipes first. Make so many goddamn pipes. How's our inventory looking? Make one more set of pipes. This is a bonker stream, because we're about to have in some pipe game. Alright, so we are here. I need to go to the right. And I can set the beacon over here so I don't forget where the cave exploration thing is going on that I'm doing. I don't remember this being here. Can I get inside or do I need like a laser cutter? I feel like I need a laser cutter. It seems pretty sealed duck. We got ourselves a grab trap, buckos. Acquired. Now I can trap them with gravity. The question is, are they a, uh, giant coral tubes give me coral tubes in there? Oh, I can just harvest- oh, I'm- wow, I'm really fucking dumb. I can't believe it took me this long. Oh, is this one of those thermal vent things that nearly killed me? That one time? <laughs> we can't go that way. Gravity, my one weakness. Yeah, I feel like a lot of people are weak to gravity. Uh, let's see, we should be able to maybe spot our oxygen thing on the surface. Maybe. That looks like something over there. Might actually be like an island though. I think it is. I think it's the top of one of these dudes sticking out. One of our giant, not a whales. Still gonna swim over to it because I can. Have I seen you before? I don't think I have. Well, this is weird. All right, that satisfied my curiosity. Reef fellas. Yeah, they make me think of the, um, the giraffe things in Horizon Zero Dawn that you have to climb the top of to expand your map, you know? That's what they remind me of. We see some tiny floaters. They're 
They got the rock all the way to the surface. Good job, guys. Good job. Y'all did such a good job. But now you don't have enough buoyancy. Okay, that one floater is doing a good job. So I'm gonna take him as well. Take you as well. Did I take damage from letting go of the floater? Okay, dude. Thank you, man. All oh, right, I was gonna read my, um, we have the Debussy survivors. Specimen with symptoms of infection. This organism is displaying signs of a bacterial infection. Bright green bliss. Oh, fuck. Forming networks around the infection sites. Pathology suggests a waterborne bacterium capable of penetrating the body through the skin and respiratory system. Underlying indications of genetic mutation and aggressive behavior? Bacterium itself is unlike any so far recorded in human exploration. Warning may be contagious. Avoid. Do not under any circumstances consume the flesh. Ah, uh, hmm. Genetic mutation and aggressive behavior. Interesting. So, like, my initial thought is, like, some kind of, um... Like, biological control or creation sort of thing. That may... So strange. Question is, is if that is what the planet is under quarantine for, or something else. Um, I cannot see shit, and then I just remembered I have a flashlight. Alright, we are still looking for our the fucking cave network. So hold on. Alright, this thing is actually kind of useless. Probably need to, like, be in underwater. Did it despawn? Like, I don't know how permanent my structures are. That would be very awkward if I spent all that energy making a, uh... Um... Oxygen... Transport... On the thing. And it's decided to walk away. I played just Horizon, like, uh, just the Horizon Zero Dawn. I didn't do the DLC just because it was just kind of a, a thing harder kind of situation. I don't know. It didn't seem... Oh, fucking tiger! Ow! Fuck you! Oh, it's fucking shooting at me! Oh, fuck you, dude! Fuck you! Um, it was fun. I liked it. It's a pretty good game. I kind of like rushed through the main quest and didn't really get distracted with side quests. Underwater projectiles. Ah! Normally bullets lose their uh, 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 impact while underwater, but these things have adapted. I need to find my fucking cave system. I would have thought it would be easy to re-find. I've been pretty good about finding it. Maybe I just need to wait for daytime. I guess my floater is not as recognizable as I thought it would be. Or I'm being crippled by the draw distance. I need to remember to scan some of these things. I keep forgetting. Oh, hold on. What was 
close that. Oh, I can switch it on and off. All right, that's first off. Did I pick up that gold, though? I did not pick up the gold. I do have silver. Ooh, that's good. There it is. Um, so hold on. I had a... Hold on, I pulled up, like, a, a, a an interface to change the battery. There it is. Change battery. How did I do that? R. Reload. Duh. Alright. Okay, now I know for future reference. Perfect. Good shit. Why do I keep doing things like that, but I'm underwater? Dang it, Dorky. Dang it, Dorky! Let's, uh, drink some water. Oxygenate. Alright, we can grab this metal, and then go back to looking for our oxygen pipe. And our continental shelf. Maybe further out. I could have sworn it was like before all of the kelp. Go away! Fuck off! Hmm. I feel like once I've hit the kelp forest, I've gone too far. <laughs> a lot of uh, a lot of people getting yeeted. That's just gonna be some fucking coral sticking out of water, isn't it? Yeah. Wait, did I? F Is that my? Ah, uh, I went like all the way fucking around. All right, let me get back. Let me try and reorient off of mine. So remember, like, the original thing, it was, like, 90 meters sort of to the right of my escape pod. That you're gonna get spoiled the waters with? Ikari, I can't believe you would spoil me like this! Comrade, what have I ever done to you? You deserve such a spoiler. Truly, I have been devastated. I may need to rethink my opinion of you. Truly, you have shown your colors today. Drake will remember this. And that flare is still going. Still glowing, baby. Do I have one of these eggs? 
the big green one. Yeah, yeah, I already have one of those. <gasps> Pipe! 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 So cool! Gamrad, there is a reason Ray calls me a villain. You know, they will in, but they never will out. Alright, so we're gonna put this bacon right here. I wanna name the bacon. Time to lay some pipe. I mean, I, I mean that literally. We've got, we got a pipe here. Now. Why did you do that, pipe? Pipe, what are you fucking doing? Ow. Wow, now I don't even have the, uh, like, um, why is it automatically placing the pipe? Why is, what is this game doing? Oh, this is not a... Why is the pipe getting worse? It used to be like there would be a, a, like, a wiggly thing showing where the pipe would go. So I could make sure it's aiming downward, but now it's just going all sorts of fucky directions. I don't really know the best way to do this. Better not be a limit to how deep I can go with the pipe. That would be annoying. It probably is. They probably don't let you take pipe everywhere. God, this is so awkward. Like, it was working just fine when I was first laying the, uh, oxygenator. And suddenly I'm getting a completely different user experience. See, if I go backwards, it works just fine. Look at this fucking squiggly line that it's going. Oh my god, that's so bad. experience do not like all right we're out of pipes we can make more but let's at least do one dive into the cave as we can go a little bit further I think if it's going to give me a hard limit on pipes, it's going to be at, like, that, um... I like a lifeline. If I'm just fucking up how to lay pipe... Yes, let, let me know how I'm supposed... how it's supposed to do, because I, I, I feel like I was doing the exact same thing as I was... did originally, and it just... I'm sequence breaking. Cool. I'll take that. 
Diamond. So cool. What happens if I shiny? Yeah, all these mushrooms contain uh, crab snakes. Look at the crab snakes go now. All right. Um. I forgot which way I came from. I am getting really scared. I think I need to go fucking around. I need to go this way. Oh, I mixed up my beacons. I was going the wrong direction. Fuck! Fuck. Fuck. All right, hopefully we don't drown. Crab snakes? Yeah. Yeah, because, you know, it's a carcinogenation. You know, everything turns into crab. All must return to crab. straight, you know, little squiggles, little squiggles, and then just <laughs> uh, alright. Didn't find anything too nuts on that dive. It looks like a crazy stunt. And then it turns into a crab snake squid. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Here we see the latest art installation by the crab snakes. The, uh, species known um, very much for its serpentine interpretation of art. Artificial gravity to attract light objects and small creatures. Mm. Yes. Hmm. Boys, holographic. I probably should make a Pathfinder tool. Seems like it would be a good idea, actually. How much fish do I have to eat? Boomerang. Get some hydration. We'll make another round of pipes. Actually, mmm. Nah, I want to check the beacon that we have and check, see if we can swim out that way and see what's going on. Hydration. That's what I meant to click. Alright. Soon. Get to Wawa. Pop off our healing. We're good on health. Um... Make a pathfinder just to have one. We need a copper ore. To drop this metal. Be sure, the sawtooth will get at it. Slag them. They can have it. We'll be fine.
Wait, I have the silver for a... I can make the habitat builder. I can make the habitat builder. Uh, I can make the habitat builder. We just need to grab the silver and copper and gold. Okay. Doing that. We're doing that. We've been waiting to do that for a while now. So before I forget, let's take another battery just so I have an keep an extra battery. Not what I meant to do. Let's go back to floating. Need the table coral, two of them. Need gold. Need silver. You would think I would have marked and named my storage stuff. If you thought I would do that, then you perhaps. I think I am a smarter serpent than I am. Thank you. <laughs> um, put the diamond and the quartz and the quartz and the diamond and the diamond, quartz and the quartz and diamond. Hey, I happen to put both of my diamonds together. And that should be... Hey, habitat builder. Hey, yo. I imagine this thing is going to unlock all Ooh, sorts of shit. designed to construct habitats capable of withstanding extreme environmental conditions. Shiny. Ooh. 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 Now we're cooking. Oh. Baby, we can make some fucking bar tables. Yes. Oh, and some trash can <gasps> permanently deconstruct unwanted items and release their constituent atoms into the atmosphere. Holy fuck. That's a trash can. God damn. Um, I think the big I think. Ah, oh, fuck. I do need lead. I've been throwing away my lead, but I actually need it. But I think to start things off, it's probably we have to make a foundation. Before we can put anything. Oh, here, where is this set up? Because it reminds me how I organize things. <laughs> yeah. We're building an underwater base? Yes. It looks like we can. Thermal plant? Nice. Spotlight. Base attached air pump. Ooh. So we have our above ocean air pump, but then we can have one down here. I wonder if we probably need to run from the surface down to our habitation center. Structural support prevents flooding. Nuclear reactor. Alien containment. Fabricator. All right. All right. So basically, we already have all the stuff for modification station. Interesting. Awesome. So we're going to need a lot of titanium and lead. Fuck me. I've been throwing away so much lead. I just need to keep an eye out for um, lead now. Eh, yeah, I see the radio. I see the radio. Give me a second. Uh, there was something else I was going to build. It was... Also, we can unpin this recipe. I wanted to build some Pathfinder. I need creep vine clusters real quick. So let's grab those. Also, we don't need that on our hotkey. Um, so we got creep vine 
there. Might as well as head down here, because we got creep vines right next to us, baby. Also, apparently, I never scanned a creep vine. Noted. Didn't mean to do that. Oh well. I also need silver to make that damn compass. Dang it! Make a pathfinder. Just in case I find myself under, like, in the caves again. I don't accidentally schwack myself. And I wanted to make... Not some pipes, but... Another bacon. Copper ore and titanium. Did I use all my copper ore? That's gold. Let me just find my titanium real quick. Ooh, that's a daisy. We'll put the table coral. No. That's my bleach case. This one, we put our gold in there. Let's go fuck off. Lithium, stalker tooth. Empty. Put a first aid kits in there. Cause I know I have one waiting for me. Copper ore. Now I have more copper ore. There's a good bit of copper ore. And titanium. Like this. Here. Get ourselves the bacon. Might as well as make a couple. Uh, why not? All right. What's our radio got? This is Life Pod 6. I have a passenger on board. Coordinates attached. We've landed a kilometer from the crash site, but there's radiation in between us and the rendezvous. Request immediate assistance. Six out. Signal Ooh. coordinates corrupted. Approximate transmission origin recorded to date to bank. I see. That's... Not sounding very good. Alright. Let's store our extra bullshit. Our extra bullshit. We're looking good. Um, let's get a round of food in us and some bladder fish for refilling our water reserves. We need lead and titanium. Titanium is much easier to get than lead. Oh, shush. What are you gonna do? Fart about it? Bah. survivors with each transmission. Yeah, I get the feeling we're kind of the only survivor. Let's just, just get this, this, this little feeling. I got a feeling and it's so appealing. Let's get together and ah, ah. I 
I think actually also what I want to do is I want to move my collection fish to my floating stuff outside so I don't accidentally cook it. Peepers and boomerang. This is a problem I did not or Four fine fellows. And apparently, I'm going to climb up. Nope. One of these is empty. Oh, hold on. I can store them in here. There we go. Good to go. Where is... Right, we have WoW Pipe. I priority passengers. Let's head to that one first. Ah! Hey! General Custer with the first leading me into the void in a good long while. Congratulations! You've won! One worm sent into the void. I hope you're happy. <laughs> Whee! Whee! Free titanium? Don't mind if I do. This is all probably going to be salt. Quartz. All right. Salt and quartz. You happy? I probably should have paid attention to what kind of out, what kind of deposits drop lead. Probably would have been the smart thing to do. I just, I just see rock and I bang rock. All right. Booga booga. And simple worm. We don't have time for things like tools. We just unga bunga. Oh, thank you for the head pads, Cameron. I like that little. How would you describe that sound? It's like a, it's like a wet crackle. You know, it's not like a sharp sound, like static. But it has like this, like this little warble to it. And I think it's really cool on this, uh, this track when it starts. Ooh. That looks like a cave. I want to go. I want to go down there and check it out. Oh, this is one of the other life pods that we passed by some time ago. Interesting. This hole, it was made for me! Whee! This is fine. Is this another exit of that underground complex I was in earlier? I think it is. No? Now that seems like a different facility. Oculus? And still! I am in danger of drowning, so let's get out. Hydrate and stretch will do. Let me just open up my uh, rebreather. <laughs> Ooh, and stretch. Oh, right. Let's get 
those hamstring. It's it's not plural because I'm a snake. I, I have one ham on a string. Alright, how much oxygen do we have left when we get to the surface? Not much. Kind of wanted to double check what was in that thing. But it's a little bit risky. So let's save it for another time. And hopefully I won't forget. High pro who is this high priority passenger? Is it going to be someone um, who is huffing their own farts, or is it like someone who's actually important? We shall find out soon. I get them ocular orbs of perceivers. Oh yeah, this track. We haven't saved in a while. Let's save. I probably shouldn't have saved, like, while I was, like, transitioning between water. If that actually means 175 meters, I think that does mean 175 meters, like, down. That's... great. I think we can... <gasps> what is that?! Oh, that looks like it's probably an enemy, but that looks so cool! I'm gonna scan it. I don't know what they are, but I wanna scan them. The biomass in this area is dominated by plant life. Picking up faint or terror vehicle signatures. I wanna scan you! Jelly Ray? You are now my favorite creature. Get back here. Get fucking back here. I wanna scan the shit out of you. Holy fuck. I want 10. I want. I want it! No! Get back here! Get back here! Okay, I don't want to drown, though. I'll get you, Jelly Ray! They really have amazing uh, wildlife design in this game. Such a varied creatures. And they make it work. Without them being like really zany, like, ooh, animal. It's aliens! Like, the deep sea is uh, strange enough. You don't gotta do too much to make it seem alien, you know? Like, look at that jelly ray. It just clipped right through the ground. Wow. Stop running away from me! I want to scan you! Yes! Jelly Ray acquired. Stop it. Jelly Ray acquired. Well, let's go ahead and hit this live pod and get this stuff. Ultra glide vents. Interesting. Integrating new PDA data. New PDA data. 